Yes, we got a Citizens Alert, very important announcement. We got MC Zubadog, a very special guest at Picasso Princessa. Right. We're both from the same hometown, Ron K. You know him from Daily News, beloved community icon, now with the Saving LA Project, doing so many big things in the city. It's a real forced entity to be dealt with. Ron, why don't you talk a little bit about your meeting today, and it's also a little bit about the DWP, the things that you're doing with that. Let's clear up one thing. We're not going back to Cleveland, right, brother? Oh, especially not this time of year. We just came from Cleveland. You gotta blame it on Cleveland. You got Ron K and Zuma Dog unleashing on the blogosphere. And there must be something in Cleveland, because we also got Herb Weston and Jan Perry from Cleveland. Well, but about those people. LA is becoming a lot like Cleveland. That's the whole problem. It's totally going to hell. And the people know it and can still do something about it. And that's all any of us are trying to do is to keep LA from becoming like Cleveland. Well, I think the good thing that Ron's doing right now, it, it provides a focus place for everybody to come together to uh, move in one direction. And uh, let's talk about the DWP, what you're trying to do there with some accountability. That's very important. Well, there's so many people been involved in the DWP for so long. They got a, a memo of understanding with the, the utility, and then the utility who doesn't want to really talk to them. So uh, Nick, Pet, uh, Nick Petsouris tried to, who's the president of the DWP commission, tried to get a ratepayer's advocate, and they all like railroaded that into oblivion. And so what they've done now is the people who are on the MOU committee are forming their own committee, the same people outside the DWP, and gonna, they're going to be our ratepayers advocate. And that's based on neighborhood council members, is that correct? They're neighborhood council members who know a lot about the inner workings, and they are going to go to work as citizens and provide the same information that the city doesn't want to give the people, and they're going to embarrass the city, and then we're going to set up taxpayer advocates. And if the city wants to fund it, that's great. If not, then we'll get all the help we need uh, from citizens, from CPAs, from lawyers. And we're taking back this town. We got, Ron K. we got Ron K. We slap Zuba Dog with Zap. We zap him and slap him. And we got a very special guest. Come up. We got a city attorney candidate in the house. Come out in the frame. We can squeeze in one more person. The most important thing in the city, Carmen Mr. Tonis. That's right, he's running for city attorney against Jack Weiss, and Zuma Dog is here to say we got two very important things. We got to make sure that Richard Alarcon is defeated, and we have to make sure Carmen Nuch Trutanich is elected city attorney. Want to say hello and just address the constituents and tell them why it's so important you win, y'all. Ron is right. We need to have transparency in this city. We need to open up the books and let the citizens know what's going on. No longer can we do things behind closed doors. This city needs to know what's going on. We need to know we have to have strong advocates from both the citizen side and from the uh, politicians to, to make sure that people are informed, that they know where their buck is being spent. If you're going to pay a tax dollar, you want to know it's wisely spent. And Carmen was saying earlier that Laura Chick is trying to uh, do an audit on Rocky and he's fighting it. Carmen says, hey, it's like a free oil change. It's a free checkup. He more than welcomes it. And I heard Carmen say many times that he endorses transparency in government in the city attorney's office. And I'm here to say, very important. Don't take it. Everyone votes for president. Everyone votes for mayor. I'm here to tell you, you do not know how important it is that this man, Carmen Trutanich, becomes the city attorney. True Tarnish, as in true. So when you look at the city attorney uh, election ballot and you see the word true, Tarnish, hit the chat, y'all. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you. <laughs> you know how much this guy is, wants this 